Hi everyone, I'm Mariko Kashimamata Peeling. I'm Mrs. Pan Pacific 2020 International. When I met my husband, I was a university student. We had survived long distance love between Japan and the US for over 10 years, and we got married in the US in 2012. The greatest thing about our relationship is we have the same value on family, love, life, and everything, so that we can share anything and grow up together. And I love he loves and respect me as who I am, not just as a wife or woman. That aspect is really important to me. And that's why I was totally shocked that my friend told me that she had to quit her job when she got married and she could not enjoy her beauty like before because she got to be a mom. Her struggle made me wonder why Japanese women had to feel that way. So I went back to Japan to go to graduate school at the University of Tokyo. While I studied sociology, I realized that social bias were obstacles for Japanese women. For example, according to Saver, wives do seven times as much housework as husbands in Japan. And also according to research, Japanese women feel they have to lose weight even though they are not overweight at all. I feel there is so much pressure on Japanese women how they should be and look as women, wife, and man. And I believe those social biases are obstacles for Japanese women to achieve what they really wanted to. With that knowledge I have learned, I decided to commit to creating a better society for women. So I will like for them to do those. Number one, they have to understand the existence of social prejudice. And number two, to get knowledge and support to overcome the constraints of society expectations. To help with them, I am writing an academic paper of relationship between married women and beauty. The topic is about beauty pageant and having set up the community which encourage Japanese women to learn and talk about their own social issues, and being involved with the new pageant for plus-size women in Japan. I am 40 and I'm back to school, and I'm wife and I enjoy my own fashion, beauty, and I pursue what I want to do. We don't have to fit what society expects us to be, because we can be truly beautiful when we follow our heart, not social standards. I'm so excited to see you all in Tennessee. See you!